We have more news in fact coming in right now. BJP ally in Lok Sabha backs opposition in the no trust war. Mizo National Front MP votes against the NDA in the no trust war after Rajya Sabha. The Lok Sabha Mizoram MP opposes the NDA. Mizo MP alleges his mic was turned off. The MP votes against NDA in the no trust war. This is the lone Mizo National Front MP. MNF MP who has voted with the opposition on the no trust vote ndli votes against the nda so it's a bit of a setback there in terms of the optics here anyway your own ally is voting against you though of course we know the vote has been defeated ndli votes against nda after outburst by lone mnf mp in rajya sabha mnf supporters supports opposition no trust motion in lok sabha Mr Lal Songra you're speaking with India today right now sir in the voting that took place yesterday on the no confidence motion sir did you vote with the no confidence motion or to defeat the no confidence motion well i i i voted for the motion in support of the motion why so sir you're a part of the nda mnf is uh, yeah very true i'm part of the nda but uh, in view of the situation in manipur the handling of the manipur crisis my party is not uh, happy with the handling of the manipur crisis okay my so you think the center and the state are not doing enough are not sir? happy sorry sir yeah yeah this one yeah this one i'm saying they are not doing enough what more could they do sir in order to well they could uh, take the uh, tribals into confidence the tribals don't have the tribals they are cookies the zoos the, the mizos they don't have confidence in the state government it's because they lack confidence no there is no trust on the state government okay so a and trust has to be created a uh, palmi sahai is joining us with the very latest on that palmi you had a word with the member of parliament it's ironic though uh, you know the optics of it not too good The motion, of course, has been defeated. But the fact is that this MP says, "A, my mic was turned off." And the very fact that the Home Minister addressed the people from the northeast, Manipuris, and as mine Maris, and that is not something that I appreciate. Clearly disappointed. That's right. Uh, the Mizo National Front, of course, uh, took a stand yesterday in Parliament, both in the Rajya Sabha and in the Lok Sabha. In the Rajya Sabha, of course, uh, there was this outburst by their lone uh, member of Parliament as well, where he spoke uh, when he said that it was absolutely disappointing that the Home Minister, in his speech earlier, had referred to those who were living, in fact, uh, cookies who were living in uh, 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 in states like Mizoram, in Manipur, as well as. Uh, you know some in meghalaya as well as uh, you know uh, as those who had infiltrated into india from myanmar as myanmaris he objected to that saying we are 100% indian we've been living here for many many years he of course was speaking about himself as well so that was of course the objection that he had to the home minister's speech in the lok sabha yesterday as well uh, the mizo national front the lone member of parliament in fact uh, voted with the motion against the government he sat in the house he did not walk out with the opposition but when the voting happened of course it was a voice vote and in the absence of any opposition uh, the government easily defeated the motion but he raised his voice and he raised his voice in support of the motion because he believes that the government has not handled the situation well in manipur and of course they are offended by the fact uh, that the government um, at least the home minister in his speech had tried to infer that all who were in fact living um, cookies who were living in manipur in mizoram were in fact those who had crossed over from myanmar also i want to get a sense from you why did the why did the chair in fact consider it an important or considered it important rather to ensure that this does not go as recorded proceedings and said that nothing of this is going to go on record as his mic was switched off 
Well, that is up to the chair's uh, discretion. You know, I mean, why the chair would want to uh, t uh, turn off someone's mic while he, of course, is making a point or an objection. That is, uh, as far as the chair's discretion is uh, concerned, uh, that is uh, something that a member of parliament can protest. But everyone, of course, heard what the MNF uh, uh, MP said in the House. And, of course, it's gone viral as well because, obviously, it is a moment of embarrassment for the NDA, for the Bharatiya Janata Party. Uh, but obviously, uh, it's a long task. They believe that, you know, because of the fissures that have been created between the two ethnic communities after clashes broke out in Manipur uh, on May 3rd, uh, there is a lot of mistrust. There is a lot of uh, anguish. There's a lot of disappointment that the center wasn't doing enough. The state wasn't doing enough. The center does realize that the process of, uh, in fact, first restoring peace complete law and order in Manipur, which is priority, is going to be a one that is ongoing. And as far as bridging the gap, which has uh, happened between the two communities as a result of uh, these clashes breaking out, that's going to be a long-term task as far as the centre and the state are concerned. The view from the Bharatiya Janta Party just yet on the fact that their ally essentially uh, did not vote uh, in favor of the of the central government. Also, I want to ask you. I think this is the first instance, uh, as far as this uh, no confidence motion is concerned, that an ally voted against the government. Uh, Paul, me. Well, yes, it is, of course, uh, embarrassing for the government because, uh, you know, in the past, of course, it was a former ally that brought uh, ahead a no-confidence motion against the government in 2018. That was the TDP because uh, the TDP had split away from the government over non-allocation of funds for Andhra Pradesh and special status for Andhra Pradesh. And then, of Follow course, me in a moment forward. from now, we have, in fact, Majid Memon of the TMC also join us. Mr. Memon, I want to ask you, what do you make of this? An ally of the NDA says... We are not happy. We are not being allowed to speak. We've been called Myanmaris. Manipuris and Myanmaris. The MNF has decided to vote against the government with a no-confidence motion. It's an NDA ally. Well, the uh, speech of the Prime Minister, which was uh, a prolonged 133 minutes long talk, spoke very little about the main issue of Manipur. As of everybody, the whole nation heard hmm. it. He was more concerned about finding uh, fault of Congress and the history from 1960, 60, 62 onwards. He did not speak uh, much about uh, the uh, burning of uh, Manipur at all. Now, therefore, at the end of the uh, uh, no-confidence motion, the voice vote was taken, which is very vague, because naturally the... The opposition, most of the opposition members had already left the house, and mm. uh, the prime minister can when prime minister wound up his speech. You see, there were hardly uh, a part of the opposition uh, available or present, or other right. not there. And now it is discovered that some portion from NDA itself, some members from the NDA, are themselves uh, expressing their. A view that they were in support of no confidence motion. Mm. I think the prime minister and his other colleagues who were supporting, who were speaking against the motion, you know, are uh, bound to convince the country. No okay. matter the formal uh, uh, vote of uh, voice vote was in favor of the government as recorded, but I think they should now uh, explain as to how some of the NDA members also say that we were in support of no confidence motion it's a matter of disgrace it's a shame for the government mm -hmm. to stand up and say that yes we have won the confidence of the people of this country okay so you are saying that this government has to do a bit of a rethink because its own allies are not supporting it is what you said absolutely apart from those who are opposing the government those who are claimed to be a p integral part of NDA, if they themselves have now, now coming out and saying that we, we, we supported the no-confidence motion, I think it's a failure on the part of the government. Thanking you for the moment, uh, Mr. Majid uh, Memon, for sharing your views with us. We are reporting on MNF MP, lone MP from Mizoram, an ally of the NDA that has gone or rather chosen to vote against the government in the no-confidence motion.